What would life be like if you were the second born child in a royal family? Would it be a lot of ribbon cuttings and personal appearances? Or would it be something out of this world? We had a chance to get the scoop from Peyton Elizabeth Lee and Niles Fitch, the stars of The Secret Society of Second Born Royals, a new superhero film that premieres in September on Disney+. Hi, nice to meet you. How are you doing today? Hey, how are you? Are you great or just so-so? <laughs> great so far. Great. So far. Can you tell me about the Second Born Royals? Are there secret ones that we don't know about? Like, is Prince Harry there? I mean, uh, <laughs> like in the room. not in the movie. I didn't meet Prince Harry, which would have been really cool. But pay attention to some Easter eggs because you may see a familiar face in there. And speaking of Easter eggs, Hakuna Matata is mentioned and you were in The Lion King at one point. Was that because of you or uh, just a surprise? Uh, so I remember when the line was in the uh, the line was in the script and I remember when I said it, they were like, hey, what do you think of that line? And I was like, I love it, you know, like, and Anna then was like, oh, yeah, like you were young Simba the Lion King. Like, that's such a cool little Easter egg that, you know, kind of a neat little thing, isn't it? Yes. It, when so you two were, were looking at the, the, the powers that they all have, did you say I'd rather have this power than that power? No. no. Pretty yeah. much all the powers were in the script when we both read it for the first time. But did you say, Peyton, did you say, I wish I had that power instead of the one I got? <laughs> no, I did not. Yeah, and, and neither did I. I think our, especially her and I, we have such like- We have the best ones. Power, powers, like they're so cool. <laughs> well, have they talked about there would be more of these? Like, would there be more adventures you'd be able to have? I mean, well, the movie ends uh, and, you know, it, it's, we don't know. I mean, you see us form a team and I, I guess we'll see where the, what it does, what, where our team goes, whether, you know, we stay a team, who knows? Would you uh, like that? Yeah, I, I'd always love to come back and work for, for Disney. I mean, they treated us great. Uh, we got to go to Toronto. We got to, you know, a, as kids being a, a, a city for the first time we'd never been in. And it's, and, you know, that's an amazing thing. And once in a lifetime opportunities type type uh, type situation. So I would I would for sure be down to come again. You two are so blessed to be in this business. And you know, a lot of young people wish that they could be in the business too. But what don't they realize about what the work is like? Um, I would say, I don't know that people don't realize it, but I would just say that it is a lot of work. You know, there is a ton of work involved and you really have to love the work and the craft and what you do um, rather than, you know, being focused on, you know, the parties or the events or the red carpets or whatever it is that you're interested in. You have to know that like, that's just sort of background noise to the focus of what we do, which is storytelling. Is that the same with you, Niles? Yeah, I 100% agree with that because if you're not, you're not gonna get the parties and all those cool, you know, accessory type things if you're not doing the work. And, and, and not only that, uh, you know, uh, could you ask your question one more time? Sure. How, what don't they realize about your kind of position in, in this business? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure they think it is all the fun and games things. It isn't really like I've got to do this scene over and over. I've got to memorize the lines. I've got to do all that. Maybe work later than I want to work. Yeah. So I, and I, I, you know, those are all trials and tribulations, but I feel like the, the bigger trial and tribulation is us being a kid and trying to juggle it and us going to school and us trying to, you know, whether we're trying to, you know, uh, go to college or not, you know what I'm saying? And, and trying to balance that. And, you know, it, it's, it's, it's very hard. It's very hard for us to succeed in trying to 100% put our foot, uh, you know, in the door when it comes to acting and then also put 100% effort in the school, you know? And, you know, I think that's something that this film was really heavy on, like, we're knocking out our school, we're knocking out our school, like y'all aren't doing anything till we knock out our school. And that's such a rarity. And I feel like that's something that people don't think about, you know, the, you know, sets tough, and it's very tedious, you know, but the, 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 the things that come with it, you know, acting is just not when I go to set and when I leave, but it's a life, it, it's a, it's a lifestyle, because, uh, you know, I, let's say I, I have to, I'm doing interviews all day, I'm in college right now. Like I, I, I'm getting into arguments with- Get those people. grades, right? I'm, yeah, I'm, you know, it, it's a different hey, thing. Peyton, can I ask you about friendship? 
you know, these are people who come together and they become friends, but how do you, how can you trust somebody? How do you know if they really are a friend? Well, that's a great question. And the answer is, I don't know how you know when you can trust someone. Um, because that's a big thing with these kids. They are all, do I trust this person or not? Yeah, honestly, I think for me, I just, I like to trust people kind of right off the bat until someone proves you wrong, you know, and like giving everyone the benefit of the doubt and saying that, you know, I'm sure this is a great person. I'm sure like I can trust them. And then, you know, obviously if you can't, then you learn from that. Um, but I don't think it's any way to go through life being worried about, you know, not, you know, having trust issues with people. So I guess the upshot is give them a chance. Yeah. I mean, I would say so. Well, thank you all. And sometime I want to learn how to do the handshake. Okay. Secret handshake of this group. Oh yes. We are, Cause we have, we have so many. There are a <laughs> lot of things to do, right? Isabel yeah. made us learn a new one every other day. <laughs> so cool. Well, I want to learn. Thank you so much. Great. Bye. Bye.